Now in this video lesson, we're going to elaborate the cosine of 5a and that's equals to 16 cosine 5 uh, to the power 5a minus 20 cos cube a plus 5 cos a. We need to show this after elaborating the cosine of 5a. Uh, so let's elaborate this. Let, let me write first the left hand side. That's cosine of 5a. Now my dear friend, can you can you solve this cosine of 5a? We don't have any formula for cosine of 5a. You know? So what we have to do, we'll break this 5a uh, into the cosine of twice of a plus thrice of a all right now we break this and now this will be something like cosine of a plus b all right the formula for the cosine of a plus b as we had learned is cos a cos b i mean cosine of a cosine of b minus sine a sine b okay so this is the formula for cos a plus b and exactly the same formula we'll be using here and we'll be imagining this as a a and 3a as a b so it will be cosine of 2a times cosine of 3a and then minus sine of 2a times sine of 3a okay so now let's further use the formula of cosine of 2a that's 2 cos square a minus 1 now you can ask me the question why i'm using the cosine of 2a formula as a cosine form because cosine of 2a has other formula also like like 1 minus 2 sine square a we have 1 uh, we have we have we have 2 cos square a minus 1 and 1 we have in tangent form so tangent we really don't need now so why i didn't use this one why i use this one i use this one because the final all answer is in cosine form all right so that's why we're going to convert every sign and other stuff into the uh, other uh, multiple angle like twice of angle thrice of angle into the simplest form into the most simple form that is a format all right so we'll be converting everything into the cos a format whatever the power is that does not matter but each and every like 3a 2a will be converted into the simple cosine of a format all right so i converted this and now cosine of 3a formula i'm going to write here all right uh, i hope you're remembering the formula of cosine of 3a that's 4 cos cube a minus 3 cos a and this i'm going to write now so it's going to be now 4 cos cube a minus 3 cos a minus now sine to a formula i'm going to write sine to a formula is twice of sine a times cos a and after that sine 3 a formula again we need to use so sine 3 a formula if you're remembering sine 3 a formula is it's sine comes first it's 3 sine a i hope you're remembering why i said sine comes first all right so 3 3 uh, i think i had told this in the last video uh, 3 sine a minus 4 sine cube a all right so the same formula i'm using here it's 3 sine a minus 4 sine cube a all right so let's elaborate further now 2 cos square a will multiply this 4 cos cube a so it will be now 2 times 4 that is 8 and cos this is a square and this is 3 so it will be power 5a and now this term will multiply this term so 2 times 3 that is 6 and cosine of square it is and now it is 1 so 2 plus 1 that is 3a and now 1 will multiply this 4 so it will be minus 4 cos cube a and this minus minus plus and it will be simple 3 cos a we deal with this thing all right we finish this part now let's do this one okay uh, one thing is here common you know my friend sine a sine a so let's take out sine a common outside so 2 sine a cos a as it is and after taking this sine a it will be square all right sine of a and since this has been already gone outside so it will be 3 and there was uh, you know there was sine cube a so one sine had been here so it is 4 sine square a okay so and in the next step it is 8 cos to the power 5a minus now 6 cos cube a minus 4 cos cube a so 6 plus 4 that is 10 cos cube a plus 3 cos a now minus uh, this 2 sine square a i already told you our all answer is in the format of cosine so i'm going to convert this sine square as a uh, let me write it it's 2 and sine square a is actually 1 minus cos square a times cos a 
and it's 3 and 4 sine square a. So I'm giving another bracket here. Uh, 4 sine square a. So it will be 4 times 1 minus cos square a. Bracket close. Another bracket close. Okay. So it's 8 cos to the power of 5a minus 10 cos to the power of cube a plus 3 cosine of a. Okay. And uh, now further when I will multiply by 2, first I will multiply this uh, cos and 2, so it will be 2 cos, uh, simple cos a minus this 2 will multiply, so it will be 2 cosine square and this cos will multiply, it will be cube a, alright, bracket close and another bracket is 3 minus 4 uh, plus this 4 cos square, because this minus and this minus will be plus, so it will be 4, uh, 4 cos square a bracket close okay further it is going to be 8 cos to the power of 5 a minus 10 cos cube a plus 3 cosine of a all right and now uh, what we can do uh, it's 3 minus 4 all right so it's it's basically this is minus 1 all right uh, okay i'll do it in the next step no problem 2 cos a minus 2 cos cube a bracket close and this is now 4 cos square a minus 1 all right because 3 minus 4 is minus 1 and now we can multiply it and we can write it so it is 8 cos 5a minus 10 cos cube a plus 3 cos a and now see here it's minus 2 cos a we'll multiply this 4 cos square a so it will be 8 cos cube a similarly minus 2 cos a will multiply this minus 1 so it will be minus minus plus and it will be simply 2 cos a and again uh, minus and minus it will be plus so plus 2 cos cube multiply this uh, 4 so uh, 2 times 4 that is that is going to be 8 cos and this 3 and this 2 so it will be 5 a you know how we get this plus when this minus will multiply this minus it will be plus and plus 2 will multiply this 8 so you will get plus 8 and cos cube a will multiply cos square a so it will be cos to the power 5a and now again plus 2 cos cube a will multiply this 1 so it will be now minus c minus times minus plus plus times minus it will be minus all right and 2 cos uh, cube a okay 8 cos 5a and 8 cos 5a so it is going to be 16 cos to the power 5a now minus 10 cos cube a and uh, minus 8 cos cube a minus 18 and minus 2 18 minus 18 and minus 2 minus 20 so it's minus 20 cos cube a now 3 cos a plus 2 cos a 5 cos a all right so it's going to be 5 cos a and what's our right hand side let me take a look once Yes, yeah, 16 cos to the power 5a minus 20 cos cube a plus 5 cos a. Exactly that we get. And that's our right hand side. So this is how we use uh, the many different formula that we had learned, all right? The formula of uh, thrice of angle, you know, cos, cos 3a, sin 3a. Similarly, twice of angle cos 2a. Somewhere we use, I think, sin 2a also here. Sin 2a, all right? And cosine of a plus b. So all the formula uh, we need to use. As we are going to learn more and more, that all concept we need to remember all right we are learning the concepts and we're using the concept one by one and later and later after learning a lot you know we need to use all the concept at once all right while step by step while solving problems or learning trigonometry we'll be using very simple 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 and then complex and then complex and more complex more complex and you know the same way we need to use the concept we need to use first one concept then two concept we need to combine in one question then three concept will combine four concept and similarly many concept combines together to give you a complex uh, form so for that you need to be very good in the fundamentals and very good in the formula all right so everything you need to learn one by one step by step and if there is any more confusion or anything like that then please feel free to comment below this video i really i will be really happy to hear something from your side all right i'll see you in the next video with the next concept goodbye